Welcome back everyone. Today is Saturday and we have Gospel from Luke chapter 9 verses 57 through 62. As they were proceeding on their journey, someone said to him, I will follow you whatever you go. Jesus answered him, Foxes have dent and birds, birds of the sky have nests, but the Son of Man has now here to rest his head. And to another he said, Follow me. But he replied, Lord, let me go first to bury my father. But he answered him, Let the dead bury their dead, but you go and proclaim the kingdom of God. And another said, I will follow you, Lord, but first let me say farewell to my family at home. To him Jesus said, No one who sets a hand to the plow and looks to what was left behind is fit for the kingdom of God. In today's message, we are presented with a challenging and thought-provoking message from Jesus Christ. This passage highlights the call to discipleship and the commitment required to follow Jesus Christ uh, wholeheartedly. It calls us to examine our own readiness to take up the cross and follow Him. As we read the passage, we encounter three individuals who express their desire to follow Jesus Christ. They seem eager, willing, and ready to become his disciples. Yet Jesus' responses to them reveal the depth of commitment required for true discipleship. The first per person says, I will follow you wherever you go. Jesus responds by highlighting the challenges of following him, including the lack of a um, comfortable home. This challenge reminds us that discipleship may require us to leave behind the comfort and security of our old lives. The second person tells Jesus, let me go first and bury my father. But Jesus instructs him to, uh, to let the dead bury uh, their dead and to proclaim the kingdom of God. This challenge emphasizes the urgency of Jesus' message and the need to prioritize it above all other commitments. The third person declares, I will follow you, Lord, but first let me say, uh, let me say farewell to my, to my family at home. Jesus responds by cautioning that no one who sets a hand on the plow and looks to what was left behind his feet for the kingdom of God. This conveys the importance of undivided focus and commitment in following Jesus Christ. Through these interactions, Jesus makes it clear that discipleship is not a Casual commitment. It, de it demands our full, full attention. 
a willingness to leave behind our old lives and a dedication to mission of proclaiming the kingdom of God. Today, Jesus presents uh, today, Jesus presents us with a profound challenge to assess our level of commitment to Him. Following Christ wholeheartedly is a transformative journey that requires us to leave behind our, our old lives. Prioritize His message and focus on the kingdom of God. As we reflect today on this passage, let us consider the cost of discipleship and the urgency of, proclaim, uh, of proclaiming his message. Finding strength and inspiration to follow him with uh, unwavering dedication. I wish to everyone a wonderful day. May God bless you.